Guo Kan or Kuo Kan, was a famous general of Han Chinese descent who served the Mongol Khans in their western conquests and the conquests of China itself. He was descended from a lineage of Chinese generals. Both his father and grandfather had served the Khan, while his ancestor was Guo Zi, a famed general of the Tang dynasty. He was not a senior Mongol commander but was in charge of Chinese artillery units under the Mongol Empire. He was one of the foreign legions that served the Mongol Empire, and some of the later conquests of the Mongols were done by armies under his command. The biography of this Han Chinese commander in the Yuan she said that Guo Kan's presence struck so much fear in his foes that they called him the Divine Man, Birth and Lineage. Guo Kan was raised in the household of Prime Minister Shi Tianzhe, military legacy. He took part in the final drive in the conquest of the Jin dynasty, including the capture of Kaifeng, and may have served in the European campaign with Subutai a few years following the fall of the Jin dynasty. He then served in Hulagu's invasion of the Middle East, playing a major role in the capture and battle of Baghdad, reportedly devising the strategy of using the dikes to drown the caliph's army and supervising the reduction of Baghdad's walls. He was then appointed governor of Baghdad by Hulagu, and at some point after Kublai Khan's accession as Khan, Guo Kan went to serve him, instead of his brother, and assisted Kublai Khan in the conquest of the Southern Song, and ultimately the unification of China proper under the Yuan dynasty. Conquest of Song China After he returned to Mongolia with Hulagu Khan after Monka Khan's death, Guo Kan was taken from Hulagu's command, and assigned by Kublai Khan to aid him in the difficult conquest of Southern Song Dynasty of China. Kublai's accession as Khan left him able to select the best of the Mongol generals to serve him. Subutai and Jebba were both dead of old age, and Guo Kan was the last of the dreaded dogs of war, and the new great Khan Kublai assigned Guo Kan to command of the final conquest of China. Guo Kan reportedly urged him to adopt a Chinese-style dynastic title, establish a capital and central government, and build schools. He reportedly was the general who proposed capturing Zhang Yang as a strategy for invading the Southern Song. He defeated Song forces in a battle at Zuzhou in 1262, and in 1266 urged Kublai to establish military farms in Waibei to provide supplies for an invasion of the Southern Song. In 1268 and 1270 he suppressed local rebellions, and then he was sent to participate in the siege of Zhang Yang. In 1276, the Song dynasty fell, and Guo served as a prefect for one more year before dying. As example of Mongol meritocracy, more than any army in history until the 20th century, and more so than many even in the modern era, the Mongols promoted strictly on the basis of military skill and ability. Like his brother, dogs of war, Jebba, son of an ordinary warrior in a tribe which had opposed Genghis Khan in his unification of the nomads and Subutai, son of a blacksmith, Guo Kan, ethnically Han Chinese, represented the revolutionary concept of promoting the sons of the most humble, or foreign-born, to command any of the Mongol nobility, including relatives of the great Khan. Though Bati was nominally in charge of the invasion of Europe, it was Subutai who truly commanded. Equally, Guo Kan devised the strategy which reduced the powerful walls of Baghdad in mere days, after destroying her small, but brave and disciplined army in mere hours by drowning them. Promotion by merit, not birth, was one of Genghis Khan's most important innovations, and Guo Kan, from an ethnic group of the Mongols' strongest rivals, was one of his prized generals, loyal to five generations of great Khans. H. H. Howarth argues that Guo Kan is the corruption of the name of Mongolian commander Kokai Lge of the Jalayir. Nazir al-Din Tuzi, Rashid and Bahibrius mention a certain Ali, Asu Chubahada as Hulagu's governor in Baghdad. Peter Jackson and John Boyle all also supported Howarth's hypothesis.